a city full of road cones, um, the simplest thing that I think has had the biggest impact, one of the biggest impacts around mental health, um, has been this. Just put a flower in the top of a road cone. A tiny action completely changes the way we interact with the space around us. The thing that we needed to continue on with was the very, very seed underneath the student volunteer army and beneath the branding, beneath the people, beneath any personalities and egos and everything. It was this fact that after a major chaotic event, a whole lot of people went and helped each other. The crisis and the disaster that's come after the earthquake in Christchurch has been when we've forgotten that. The challenge, our challenge as a country, is how we learn from the best of Christchurch, the best of this way of a disaster recovery, the best of every learning and lesson that comes out of it, and how do we go back to that place? How do we move this thing from trying to be an organization, but actually just to realize it's a movement, there's a one very good seed idea at the bottom of it, and that's that uh, people like to help out other people in their communities, and you just need to find better ways to make that happen. And so this group of us are really excited to be launching today a concept called Serve for New Zealand. Serve for New Zealand is around doing one hour of volunteering on public holidays in New Zealand. 